Hi, this is Kilgard, and today we'll be talking about scroll provinces and particularly the scroll tournament. For humans, this type of provinces and this tournament is costly. Prepare to have a lot of losses and to have great troubles with the fights. Auto fights is pretty hard in this one, so there'll be lots of manual fights and overall quite a pain in the ass. Sorry for the language. Why is that? Because of the troops we'll have to face. That's a good example of what we go against. Dryads are a mage killer, lots of move, lots of range, quite a decent damage, mage units, archers units, and AV range units as the deserters. Problem is, if you check your diagram, light range are strong against mages and heavy melee. Mages are strong against heavy melee, heavy range, and enemy heavy range are strong against light melee and light range. So whatever you send, one troop is strong against it. All troops have a minimum moves of three and minimum range of three, meaning they can hit pretty much everywhere they want. Most of the time with uh, other encounters, we'll have to face melee unit, limited range, limited movement, but not in this case, there, there's guys can go ev pretty not everywhere they want, but they can hit pretty much everywhere they want. So, tough fights. I don't know for you, but I'll be doing the negotiation a lot in those fights. Most uh, up to, I'd say, three, four, five, six stars. Five or six always negotiate. The fights are way too tough. And with that combination, you'll get slaughtered. And probably up to three or four star, you'll be thinking about going with the negotiate button. So. To go against the main, the, the range units will be using uh, either light melee or heavy range. For a mage, we need uh, light melee or light range. And for the deserters, the heavy range units, we will need uh, mages or uh, heavy melee. Mages will get slaughtered before they can do anything in those fights way too much range which they are strong against so don't even think about sending mages in those fights totally useless you just lose one unit before you can even use it so one or two uh, av melee to try to deal with uh, the av range unit and the rest will go with light melee units. So as usual, send one troops to look at the terrain. Pretty open. That troop won't be able to do much on the first round. The rest can go pretty much everywhere they want. One quite fast. So surrender. And let's try to Face the music. So, for this one mage, I will send one dog. For the other's range unit, I will send the drone rider, a light melee unit that is developed quite uh, farther along the research tree. If you don't have it, your good old barbarian will do the tricks. But barbarians are pretty much even, they have one range and three move, the advantage of the B Rider being four move. So much more chance to connect with the enemy and 90% extra damage against light range units with a 30% damage reduction is something you want to use. Also uh, good hit points, so we'll go with that. So. And I'll finish with a Paladin to try to deal with this guy. I do hope he won't get uh, shot to death before doing anything. 
as usual the enemies goes first okay nothing I can do about this guy I can get it where I want him to be if I close one two three four five six seven probably advance there one two three four five six seven okay if I close this gap my dog won't be allowed won't be able to pass to get the mage so I'll go one two three And there's this big guy. I'll send this one here to pretty much no effect. But I wanted to keep the, the, the way open for my mage. Wasted occasion because he advanced just one move. So go as fast as you can. So use the drone riders to kill the range units you can. They are quite effective at that. The dogs to kill the mages. And I can hit leave you range with my paladin that guy is pretty much dead okay get rid of this one you go there you go there That would get rid of them. And now it's just a finish up. And that's it. As you see, used wisely, not that much damage, but still quite no way it can be avoided and if i had to fight with more uh, av range i would need more paladins that means less troops to fight the archers so that's it folks thanks for your time